Hi Kate, it's Chelsea. I have another project for you. Please do let me know if I'm sending too much your way that you just can't get done. Um, that's no problem, just give me a shout. If not, I'm gonna keep sending you stuff. Uh, so here's what I need. This woman, um, Rachel Evans, uh, has a career values quiz on the back of her site. So here I am after logging into her site and I'll provide you with those credentials. And I've gone down to quizzes and surveys and then I found the career values quiz which is on the second page um, of the, here I'll show you that. So here's, pay. I went to page two. And there's the values quiz. So I wanted to edit to look at it. So this, what's in here is just going to provide you with all of the content. So all of these different questions, there's about 30 of them. Um, so that's something that you will just need to pull that. But the whole concept is she wants to be able to have a sort of a questionnaire slash quiz thing on her site. that says, hey guys, rank all of these from most valued to least valued. And then the results page will show you you're basically just give you the list that you've created. Like here are the top most valued, here are, you know, ranking down um, from most to least valued. So what she really wants is something that looks like this, where you can just say, okay, least important, most important. And then this functionality even cuts you off at some point if you put like too many in one area. It says like, you don't have any left. You can't put any more in here. You have to start putting in another area, this kind of thing. So this is the kind of quiz she's looking for. Now, I have no idea how this was built. It could have been custom coded. Um, it might be worth reaching out to somebody um, at part of this website if there's contact information and asking them, hey, how did you get this? Because I have no idea. The quiz function she has in the back of her site just will not give her what she wants. So I'm trying a new one. And it's a little bit better. It's not as ideal but I'm having trouble figuring out how to customize the results page. So here's what it looks like so far is we just need text at the top. I need to get rid of this. So that's a functionality as part of that first block that needs to go away. And then it just has everything. I only included 20 of the 30, so we need to include the rest. Um, and really what this does is just like, okay, this is more important. This goes up the list. This goes up. This stays down kind of thing. And people will just order it from there, which again, is not the most ideal because it's a little, um, it's going to be a lot 30 questions for people to go through. But if this is the option that I have, um, all of the other options for different applications online cost like 30 to $50 a month just to keep the quiz on the site. Like, I'm not going to charge my client that. That's a lot. Um, this is like a 30 dollar one-time fee for this type of quiz. So it seems more ideal, um, but that's kind of where we are with with, with that. Um, my issue is so you can submit your email address. And this is just on a demo site. I want to build this on the demo to show her to see like, hey, is this what you want? See, I got to get rid of that. I don't know what the deal is with that. But then it processes and then it says your form has been submitted. Now I need to customize this results. So it says like, please check your email to see your full list of results um, or something like that, or at least gives them the full page of results right here. It says, here's your list. And then it lists it out um, in the way that they built before or have provide some sort of downloadable report, something like that. Now, this is that large text area that needs to be modified a little bit too, if you want to try to figure out how to get rid of that box. But in the quiz settings doesn't provide us a whole lot. And results and emails, this is where you see all of the different notification messages and all the different defaults. But I don't know where that one screen is in here. Like I am struggling. I've been looking at this for so long. I think I need a new set of eyes because I'm going a little bit crazy. Um, but I don't know where, as soon as you click submit, what, which one of these can be customized to customize what that says. And then the email, there's lots of email settings, but it, you know, what options do I have? Can I automatically have the results come up in the email or in the form after signing up? Like I need some help with this to try to figure out, um, how, when somebody clicks, sends their email after they do the list. They get on a results page and either in that results page or through their email, doesn't matter either way at that point because they've already given the email, somewhere I need them to have like 
thank you for submitting your answers. Here is your full list in order of what you created. Uh, it shouldn't be a hard thing, but I do not know how to do this. So any help would be really great. <clears throat> um, and I will provide you all with the credentials, uh, the link to get to this and um, how to get into the back of the site right here for her. And if you could just finalize this quiz, build it um, out a little bit. Don't, if you end up spending like over two hours, like stop at some point, it's just too much, you know, but um, <clears throat> I didn't even see these. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm losing my voice. There's some options over here to export report. That could be a good one. Yeah, so there's more stuff over here I just, just noticed. So a lot of this could be what we're looking for. Um, it would be great for them to be able to click a button and export like a um, a list, the list for them to be able to print. So there's a lot in here. There's just a lot. And I think this is going to do what we want it to do, but I need it built in this like platform first so I can send it to the client. Is this cool? Is this what you want so that I can purchase it and then rebuild it? So don't feel as though you need to go in and add the rest of the questionnaires or anything like that. We just need to customize that final page to show her the experience she would have so that she can determine whether or not she wants to buy this um, application and have us build it. Okay, thank you.